Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. So apparently in this current 3.21 patch, there is a missile bug. I am not sure using the word bug is accurate because this might be intentional. But whether it's a bug or not, it certainly made our missile management very problematic. However, there are some workarounds that I have found, three of them so far. So I am going to share all of them with you in this video. Let's go. So this missile problem is this. I am pretty sure many of you have already found out. When you go to your vehicle loadout manager, and when you try to switch different missile types, for example, let's choose the Ares Ion. If you want to change these missiles to different types of missiles, you cannot do anything with them like these Arrestor 3 missile, you want to change them to Thunderbolt 3, usually I change that for the ship, but there is no option. For this missile rack, it's locked, so you can't change the missile racks. But for the other two missile racks, for the Ion or the Inferno, this one, 543, this missile rack, you can see if you want to change those Viper 3 missiles to Thunderbolt 3, you cannot do that and this missile rack as well. So one solution is very, very simple and fast solution. If you are able to change those missile rack, for example, for this 543, I can change them to one torpedo, 515. Once you click on that, and now you can see you have different missiles that you can change. So if you still want to use size 3 missiles, you simply change them back to 543. That's it. Now you have all those empty missiles. You can change the different types of missiles. So solution number one, if you have different missile racks that you can change to, change to different missile racks and then change them back. Now you can change to different missiles. In case that you don't have extra missile racks to switch to, the other option is simply to spawn your ship. Now what you need to do is to go to the cockpit and unlock the port. So the default key is Alt K. When you press that key on your screen, it will not show you like the previous patch says port unlocked. No, there's just nothing. So that definitely needs to be added in the game because otherwise you wouldn't know port unlocked or port locked. Once you unlock and use your tractor beam and get those missiles out of your ship. I think my tractor beam is bugged as well. I can't use it. Let me see, change different mode, change. Maybe I'm using the default tractor beam. I need to use a nice looking tractor beam like this one, the black cherry. So the ship will not recognize those ugly tractor beams. It needs a colorful one, beautiful one. Nope, don't think so. Let's try to respawn the ship and see. Star Citizen is a test of patience. It's a training ground for your problem solving capabilities okay tractor beam out i still can't use my tractor beam even though the once you get close to it the missiles are highlighted in over here i'm pretty sure this uh you can use your tractor beam in your hangar because we're gonna have persistent hangers later so if we cannot use our tractor beam in our own hangar then there's no point of per for persistent hangar. Okay, let me hop back to the pilot seat. Okay, now let's try. That's an active. Let me see what other solutions I have. Drop it. Pick it up. Oh! Alright, so that's the solution for your tractor beam. Wow. This game... This game within a game. Okay, so take out these Viper 3 missiles. I'm gonna throw it on the side so I don't block any other ships. Yeah, if that elevator is going to the hospital, <laughs> then they're gonna find out there are four big ass missiles going to the hospital. It's like, what? Where are those missiles come from? This is a hospital. 
No missiles allowed. Okay, so now we took all the missiles out. And there we go. You can see the missile slot are all empty and when you click it you can change them to different types of missiles the same size so solution number one is fast and easiest so if you can buy some missile racks just switch them around you will be able to change out those missiles solution number two you have to use some tractor beam that only if those missiles can be tractored there are many missiles in different ships that cannot be tractored like these missiles in this ion i cannot change them so solution number three is a very common sense very straightforward fire all of them and come back and you can change them to different types so let's do it really quick all right so here are some target practices I'm gonna fire all of my missiles. All of them. You cannot leave one in your missile chamber. You have to fire all of them. Being attacked from somewhere. Got a surprise for ya! Wow! I can't believe the NPC missiles in this patch are still broken. <laughs> Fire. 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 I think those two missiles missed. Oh, didn't, but did not destroy it. Whoa, that's a beautiful <laughs> explosion. Okay. Okay, so this is another bug, I guess, because I cannot. I cannot find a marker for my hangar. The ATC keeps saying request. This patch is rough. Solution is to get impounded. So I need to find where the green circle is. Oh, there we go. That's the green circle over there. There we go. I'm gonna have to pay my fines. 2000. It's not that bad. Also, pay my fine I'm for sorry. my impounded Look. vehicle. 5,000 AUEC. Look. It's not bad, but I thought it was 50,000. So. Okay, Please. there we go. So once you empty all your missile racks, you can go back to station and change them to the type that you want. I'm going to put all the Thunderbolt 3 for this. So I hope these workarounds are useful to you. And I hope CIG could restore missile management like before. Just make our life a little easier. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I will see you guys in the next one.